Hello everyone, welcome back to Hotline Topics. Lysandrine's husband was so excited as he promised to never take any other woman secretly or publicly as his wife as Liz will be his only one woman. Liz and her husband also show off their beautiful musk cake which was made by Olufemi Akombi Cakes. And earlier, Liz has come out to debunk the rumor that her husband had any other wife apart from her. She said, my husband doesn't even have the strength to keep two wives, not to talk of six wives. He stays alone in his apartment. I stay to conquer all the lies surrounding my recent marriage to my lovely husband. Being a public figure, I should have to live by example. As such, be conscious, mindful and careful of what I do. But notwithstanding doesn't mean I have to cowardly ignore ill statements being circulated on social media. I have first and foremost been very good friend to my husband for a whole 14 years. This means that I know all of his activities, whom and who he dated and have been with, which doesn't define valid and legal marriage under the act. Marrying my friend of over 14 years means he's a good man and generous man. But the reason he didn't marry them legally is not to him alone. The picture has been displayed on social media by these haters are people never known to my husband. I'm aware of the provision of the law of bigamy. Black's Law Dictionary defines bigamy as the act of marrying one person or legally married to another. The Criminal Code Law of Legal State, Cap C 17, 2004, Section 370, provides for the punishment of the act. All this myself and legal husband are aware of. So if anyone knows, now think otherwise. Such person should proceed to court to prove such or post a certificate here on social media to infect innocent followers with their height of frustration. Akobimi Mafo Uwakbelue till death to us part, where we will clock 200 years, she said. And if you have baby or babies for my husband, I will gladly accept it. Once DNA proves it, Omoni Niolua, me and my husband's mansion is big enough to accommodate 10,000 children peace. She also released a tribute to her husband, to her love. She wrote, a tribute to my love in my lovely moment, even if I become richest lady in the world. I think I need to give glory back to a selfless man that stood with 100% loyalty with no element of betrayal. The car you gave me money to buy was stolen by a man I chose over you, but you never bothered. You gave me your own personal car just to cover my shame in public. You were taken back around Lagos. You had an accident on back. You refused to tell me just for me to keep the car. Just one day, you bought me a car and an apartment just for me to rise again. When I thought it was over in Lagos, I was about to carry my shame back to Ijebode where I schooled. You said, Liz, I'm ready to sell my kidney to make you somebody in life. I wasn't this brave then. You once told me that suicide was not an option. I should stand on my feet to make it in life. That is only return you need from me. May Allah give us long life and all beautiful things of life so that I can come out and tell the whole world our story. Share kind of city people, you can testify to this guy's good deed. 14 years ago, Islands Inc. of Island Magazine, you are my witness. To me that your bad mouth of DB exclusive media. You are my manager and the closest person to me then. You know very well this is the only man I'm emotional about. If I'm not being truthful here, you guys can tell the whole world. Kudos to most kind-hearted man on earth. By this story, I'm here to pay part of my debt. Biti beji meji le me 50. Olo worimi, I'll pay my balance in my next life. That did me adibo yiga akonbi, okwa akonke, awobino ajomalo 200 years now. It was not 22 days ago that this actress and producer Lisandra shop fans wish I know that she was off the single market and married to her actress, Alaji Lawa, who had weathered the storm with her for 14 years. This new bride, who apparently couldn't contain her joy, said the wedding would have been bigger. But because of the realities of COVID-19, they had to be cautious. In an interview with Sunday Scoop, Nizanjari said, I'm happy because I'm with my best friend. I don't even feel as if I just got married. I feel that I signed a life contract with my best friend. He's my helper. He didn't allow me to take poison 14 years ago and he stopped me from committing suicide. I'm glad it turned out war between us because he's behind my success story. People mocked him. But he stood by me through thick and thin. A lot of people didn't see my wedding coming, but it's better to leave people guessing about one. We had a quiet wedding because of COVID-19. The alarm of your bala media de yemi would have been present if not for the coronavirus pandemic. Alafia has blessed me in my hobby. Even if there was no COVID-19, my wedding would have been 
in Nigeria. I've been with my husband for 14 years and a lot of media personalities know about our relationship. I had issues some years back and he was there for me. He was my cushion in the days of turbulence and crisis. He constantly reminds me that he wants nothing from me but my success. Some people mix my personality up, but there's a difference between my business and personal life. When it comes to my personal life, I always make it private. People think that I shout and show off, but I don't do that. I just do business. I have a daughter, but I don't display her on social media. I also notice that people mock me a lot, but I always want to show that, that God lives. The exciting group also told Sunday School that Liz Andrean is very respectful, pleasant, and a good cook. And he does not want to boast so much about her virtue so that people will not take her away from him. He added that he would also score her 100% on her level of perseverance and endurance. Speaking of why it took them 14 years to get married, Liz Andrew said it took them this long because she had told her late mother that she wanted to make some money first before she would get married and become a wife. And that her husband respected this opinion and told her that he would always be there for her. Now that she's his legal wife, they have done all that is necessary. If her mother were still alive, she would have been the happiest person on earth. Because according to Lizzie, her husband is a late mother's godson and he was the only man that she endorsed. Liz Andrew denied the report that her husband was previously married to any other woman apart from her and also that he had children before now that they just tied the knots. And she has clearly stated that the tractors are behind these rumors. Liz Andrew's wedding was attended by very close friends and relatives. Who is Liz Andrew? Liz Andrew is one of the most successful and richest Yuba actresses. She's also a producer and an entrepreneur. She's popularly called Lizzie Andrew, but her full name is Elizabeth Aisha Andrew. She's known for his show Nisha Ariwaejo Omi, among others. Since eating the limelight from eight years ago, Lizzie has made several movie appearances. As a producer, Lizzie has some movies on her belt, including Yawabuke, Ofotinubuko, for the first lady, and Owo Narabet, among others. Elizabeth Andre was born in Badagri, Lagos State. On the 4th of April 1980, she's currently 40 years old. She was a student activist on the campus of Olambi Senobadre University, and she subsequently went to an acting college for four years, where she met the late Duwo Gumbe and Ahmed Alasari, who were instrumental to her growth. Just a while ago, Lizzie shared a real life story and gave a lot of people who were experiencing troubles, gave them hope, inspiration, and mental strength to defeat them. And she also showed that every struggle is temporary in life, and we as humans are able to overcome them. Lizzie had a humble beginning. Also, as mentioned earlier, Lizzie has a daughter. She has been a single mom for long, and her daughter's name is Roti Me for a very long while. Lizzie's daughter was a secret. She kept her away from the public until she clocked nine years old. This was in the year 2011. That Lizzie revealed her daughter to the world. And she said she had to keep her daughter away from the public to keep her away from star dizziness because her mother is famous. Lizzie Andre had a beautiful daughter when she was a student at College of Education, but sadly lost the father of her child when the baby girl was just three months old. Lizzie Andre has won several awards, including City People Entertainment Award for Yoruba Movie Personality of the Year in 2014, City People Movie Award for Yoruba Movie Personality of the Year Female in 2017, City People Movie Special Recognition Award for her movie Warner Herbert, also in 2017, and she was nominated for City People Movie Award for Best Actress of the Year Yoruba in 2015. Apart from all these awards, she was also honored with a title as a chief of Oyo by the Mona Obala Media at the EME 3. This was just last year, 2019. This 40-year-old mother of one was installed as the Brokenia Adini of the Asian city and she had a few days of celebration. Lizzie Andrewin has several sources of income apart from being an actress and getting some acting fee. This stylish Nollywood star found another love in a new enterprise, which is fashion. She believes that as a vibrant fellow like herself, one should not depend on one line of business and definitely not like acting as many stars have been discovered every day. A while ago, she was also attached to a sugar daddy because she's one of the richest actresses in the industry. So she acquires houses and cars, luxurious ones. So she was said to be sponsored by sugar daddy. However, this actress came out to the bunk that that she only has a fictitious sugar daddy and the only sugar daddy that she has is almighty God. Also, the greatest lesson Lizzie has learned in life is that she has learned not to ever depend on anyone. 
She has learned to think about herself and her immediate family first before she thinks about other people. She has also come to learn that life is too short, so she now lives a healthy life and being very watchful of what she eats. Those beautiful actors also shared a while ago that she was the only child of her late parents. They also had at their very old age. So the story surrounding her birth was a great testimony. Congratulations once again to this newlywed, Lizzie Andre and her husband.